All right, are we back? All right. Hopefully we're back. All right, so this is the other part of the cartel, uh, Azazel Reborn. Um, so I, I don't know if you've seen the Tunnel Cartel before. But this is the, um, the largest number of barrels that we have grouped together. I believe there's, uh, two... 160-something barrels in here? booze. Let us take care of this booze. Okay, I think we got it all. I think we got it all. Let's see. I think we got it all. Just want to make sure. Ooh. No eating cranberry slippy. Alright. Let's get out. Get this, whatever this is. Ah, that's a prehistoric hand axe we don't need. Let's go check out the town. See what's going on here. Anything that's worth... Oh, it's Shane's birthday. Does anyone have an extra Joja Cola? No, we're not doing that. We're not doing that. We are not going to do that. We don't care about Joja. Robin, I suggest you drink a nice tall glass of water. Sweet, sweet water. Ooh, cranberries wine. Well, we we're gonna get rid of that cranberries wine. We're gonna keep the ancient fruit wine. So three bottles of it just to keep things nice and even. And throw the hand axe in there. And we'll deal with that a little later. Okay, so where should we put this obelisk? Hmm. Where should we put this obelisk? Ooh, I think I gotta sneeze. Sorry about this, guys. Hmm? <coughs> uh, oh, excuse me. Oh, I knew that was going to happen. I'm going to drink a water. Okay. All right. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Ms. Amber with the bless you. Very kind. All right, so where should we put this obelisk? Where should we put this thing? Hmm. I think it's four by four. If it is, it can go right here. I think it's bigger than that. I, I, I bet it's bigger than that. And I think the wizard's closed now. I don't really have... There's not enough time to go down there and check it out. That's not done yet. Hmm. I think it's, it's probably three by three. I bet it's three by three. Hmm. I don't know. 
All right, let's say it's three by three. I bet it's three by three. If it's three by three, it could go here. That might be a nice place for it. Over here. I kind of like the idea of putting it over here. Like maybe over here with these trees. Like it might look nice over here. Somewhere. Hmm. That could be an option. The um so it warps you to the beach. There's also one for the mountains that'll warp you to the mountains. The reason why I want one that warps to the beach is because the, the in order to get the... I want to get all the achievements. Um, and there are... There's three artifacts that I need. These two um, have a good chance of showing up at the beach. But it's just very inconvenient to go to the beach every day. So if I build the the uh, the obelisk for the beach, then I can quickly go to the beach, check it, and go back, you know? So that's kind of what I want to do. So these two can be found. They have a good chance of finding them on the beach. This one I need to find in the skull cave, I believe. Um, so that's going to be a difficult achievement. That is going to be a very difficult achievement, unfortunately. It's going to be a tough one. I could put the obelisk here. It might be the best thing. But I kind of like the idea of putting them all next to each other. I think that would be really cool. To like build them all next to each other. I think that would be pretty neat. Hmm. I'm not sure. I'm really not sure. Wow, these are gold now. Hmm. These are gold now. That is pretty crazy. Hmm. I guess I'm just gonna sell them. Do I have any gold quality? I don't have any gold quality of those. Do I have any gold quality? I don't have any gold. I'll, I'll keep some of them. I, I think I should keep some of them. I probably don't need them. I probably don't need to keep anything at this point. Like, in all seriousness, I probably don't need to keep anything at this point. But, I don't know. I'm just a, I'm just a baka like that, I guess. Um, we need to keep these in our inventory because um, the, uh, the other part of the cartel should be finished tomorrow. Man, where should we put these things? I want to build the other one tomorrow. I'd really like to build it tomorrow. And I think this space up here is too small. It's kind of ideal. I like I like the idea of putting them there. But uh, I think it's too small. I, I, I wonder if we should put them over here. Like, I bet all three of them could be put over here. Oops. Hmm. I wonder if all three of them could fit over here. I think they could. But I'm not sure. You know what, we'll, we'll make some space and see what happens. And as much as it pains me, I think I'm going to cut these down, these trees. Because we have the, um, we have the, um, we have the nursery now. I, I don't think this is needed. Like, I don't think we need these at all. Because we have the nursery now. Oh, but we got a warp home. It's time to go to bed. Right. Mm, we don't need to know. 
There's nothing. Okay, let's go to bed. All right. Oh, made a little bit of money today. I mean, you can you can make a lot of money just make like cranberries jelly is worth quite a bit, man. Ninety four, you get ninety four bottles or jars of that, you get eighteen k. You know, it's not bad. It's not bad. I hope you don't mind if I spend some time on my projects today, honey. The other thing I'd really like to do is, like, start working on my house. Like, improving our house. What's up, Rachel? What's up, Raphael? Such good kids, I think. As far as I can tell, they don't really do anything. They just kind of run around. Perhaps that's what real life is like as well gonna be clear and sunny all day all my mom had to do was like give me a nintendo and just i would sit down in front of the tv and just play nintendo all day it was pretty easy all right we have good luck today let's see complete breakfast last week i taught you how to make hash browns this week i'll show you how to combine them with other ingredients to create a hearty complete breakfast this meal will really fill you up and give you the energy you need to get in a hard day's work or you know how to make complete breakfast. Same here. Video games raised me. Disco Bride. Yeah, I played a lot of video games as a kid. A lot. Probably a little too much. But... It's all right. What's up, Mr. Yogi? Love that cat. Alright. And the Junimos are hard at work. Thank you, my friends. Thank you so much for doing that work. You guys are so good. Little Junimo guys, they're so great. Alright, not ready. Got a couple of ancient fruits. Okay. A couple of ancient fruit there. Alright, let's let the animal... Uh, let's go over here. Alright. I As sad as this is, I think I am going to cut these trees down. Goodbye, trees. is done. We cut down all those trees. Alright, that stuff is not ready. don't know what materials we need to make the uh, <clears throat> to make the um, the thing so we got to go see the wizard find out what is involved what is needed throw this lightning rod in here for now and a few of these tappers like, we do need a few of them though How are you selecting items in your inventory? With the mouse. Um. Hmm. Alright, let's go over here. Uh. Okay, let's go over here. 
We gotta go visit the animals too. Gotta go do the animal stuff. Okay, Sunday. Oh, Sunday. That means we got, uh... Hmm? All right, let's go in here. All right, let's get some milk. Let's get some more milk. So much milk. Alright. Oh, come back here. Come back here, sheep. Come back here, sheep. Oh, we have like a dog outside, like just barking fanatically. <laughs> like the dog has just lost its mind. I wonder what's going on out there. It is deeply disturbed by something. Let's let the chickens out. Okay. Hmm. My my settings are acting really weird today. So maybe it's me partly. Like this shouldn't be happening. Like I don't I don't know what's going on. I don't know if I started the game in a weird way or something but it's kind of acting strange for me so maybe your game is doing exactly what it should and my game is the one that's like freaking out okay so what do we okay we need to go visit well we can we can hit the we can hit the merchant on the way to the wizard. Man, I can't believe we're almost through spring. It's nuts. I feel like we just started spring. I feel like we just literally just started. Alright, let's go around here. Amber, do you have a, um, if you put it on controller style settings, do you actually have a controller plugged into your computer? That might make a difference. Like, it may, you need, maybe you need to have a controller plugged in, but use the mouse. Does that make any sense? Okay, yeah, maybe you need to try that. Maybe you need to, like, plug in a controller. Put it on controller style settings and then it'll work. I don't know, maybe. There we go. It's worth a try. It's worth a try. Well, you don't have a controller. Oh. This this test might be difficult to do then. So I mean that's that's how my oh we, we we had one more we needed one more that's that's how my setup is I have a controller plugged into my computer so maybe that's what's making the difference could be part of it I don't know uh oh I gotta sneeze again maybe not. Hmm, it could be. It could be. Perhaps that's the difference. Because I have the controller style settings, I think, on mine. Yeah, controller placement tile indicator. Use controller style menus. I have it windowed mode.
Uh-oh, what why is my computer thinking? That's not good. Uh-oh, why is my computer thinking? <laughs> Please don't crash. Please don't crash. Hmm. Ah, uh, okay, so maybe that's it. Maybe that's it. Maybe it's grayed out because you don't have a controller actually plugged into your computer. It's kind of, I mean, I don't know. I actually don't know, but it could be part of it. Hmm. Yeah, I actually have a controller plugged into my computer. So... Perhaps that is the difference. Hmm. And Jockman is back. What's on, what's going on, Jockman? All right, let's go. Oh, we got uh, we got a uh, ooh, we got honey today. Man, they're going ham on the they're going ham on the grass. Guys, come on now. Stop eating all the grass, buddies. Animals are going, they're just going absolutely ham over the grass. Ah, oh, man. Your camera pick is too small. Well, I mean, like, the thing is, I don't, you know, when I was, it, it's a good criticism. Um, when I was designing this overlay, um, I didn't want to... Like, I wanted to really, like, let the gameplay be seen. So, but it, you know, I think, I think it's worthwhile consideration if I want to change. Okay, the uh, cartel is ready. Isn't it? I thought I saw that it was ready. Okay, I guess maybe not. <laughs> maybe not. Oh my gosh, look at all this booze. Look at all this booze. Yeah, I don't know. I, I think it's uh, kind of a, a weird little design decision, you know? Like, if you want to make your profile pick really big, then there's less gameplay. But I guess that's why some folks, you know, like, superimpose their, you know, their own, their camera. You know, they, like, get a green screen. Like, Jockman, do you have a green screen? I don't think you do. Some people get, like, a green screen, and then they just, like, you know, put... They make their camera really big, and then it's just, you know, like, only part of their face is, you know what I mean, on the screen. So it's kind of like... It's very... It's very nice, you know? Okay, we missed the uh, traveling merchant. That's kind of sad. Hmm. We missed the traveling merchant. That's okay, though. Let's um go to the wizard before his place closes. Let's go to the wizard before it closes. It's gonna close really soon. Hmm. All right. So let's take a look. Okay. There's the Earth Obelisk. Okay, so it needs five iridium bars, ten clams, and ten coral. Do tashimashite. Gold clock. I think that's ten million gold. That's insane. So there's two. 
There's only two obelisks. Mountains and ocean. Five iridium, ten clam, ten coral. <laughs> Thanks for the Japan language. Uh, what was that again? Gosh, I'm such a baka. Ten clam, ten coral, five iridium. Ten clam, ten coral, five iridium. So, Jockman, are you uh, going to play some games soon? What are you thinking about streaming? What are you going to stream later? What are you thinking about playing next? Anything new? Any any new games or anything? Let's see. Same old classic, okay? More, uh... I'm going to play new games in the future. Okay, cool. in the bin. Let's see. We're going to throw this jade in the bin. Let's see. We're going to throw this blue jazz in the bin. We're going to throw this truffle in the bin. We're going to throw this honey in there. Let's see. We're going to throw this cranberry. Ooh, no, 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 no. We're going to sell that cranberry wine. We don't, we don't need that. We're going to sell that cranberry wine. I'm gonna grab this and put it in the house. Mm. Itchy nose, what is wrong with me? Some maybe there's something in my house, like some something that's irritating my my nose. It's really weird. Alright, um throw that in there. again. Well, we have 98 iron bars. It's probably fine. We could make some more copper bars. We're doing actually pretty good on, on iron bars at this point. We probably don't need so many. Let's make some more copper bars. Let's move on to make some more copper bars. Let's see. Let's see. Throw the, this in there. I think I am going to just sell this ancient fruit wine. I really don't think we need... Uh, like, we can just start selling it. Because we'll, we'll never be able to age it. Like, it's just going to take forever. I think we have over 200 bottles in here. Yeah, we have 300 bottles. We have 300 bottles of ancient fruit wine. It's going to be backed up for years. Years. It's going to take years to, to age all that wine. So, it, it doesn't matter. I really don't think it matters at all. I wish my nose would stop itching. Um, all right, let's grab the stuff we need. We need, oh wow, we only have 10 of those. We have the clams too. All right, so we have the clams. We need the five iridium bars. Five iridium bars, okay. Okay, we got everything we need. We got these for the cap for the kegs. We got some more copper. We can make some more copper. We're doing good. We're doing good. Um, I'd also like to put that uh, lightning rod back down. So I'm gonna grab that lightning rod, and uh, we may as well put the tappers out tomorrow. 
We can't even do anything with these casks. It's kind of silly. We could probably put a chrysalarium out. But uh, we'll, we'll just call it good, I think. stuff. Let's go over here. Probably have some more. Ooh, we do. Have more stuff. Junimos have been busy. The Junimos have been busy. Wow, 23 more gold strawberries. Pretty high. Let's see. Yeah, just throw this in the bin too. May as well. All right. Well, I didn't really expect to bring in a bunch of cash today, but we're going to. So that's nice. Kind of unexpected. Did not expect to. Uh, Make a bunch of cash, but here we are. Do we have any tea left? Oh, we don't. It is gone. The tea is gone, my friends. The tea's gone. All right, look at that, man. Nine, one ninety. Yeah, one hundred and sixty-five k for that ancient fruit wine. Another 13. Wow, just so much cash. It's another decent amount of cash for this day. Man. Let's see. Where's our other kid? What's up, Raphael? If my brother wasn't such a hermit, I'd invite him over for dinner sometime. She doesn't know what she's asking. Welcome to Kozu 5, your number one source for weather news and entertainment. And now the weather forecast for tomorrow. It's going to be a beautiful sunny day. Spirits are somewhat annoyed today. Here's a tip for you adventurers out there. Don't forget your weapon special attacks. Swords can block incoming attacks, which is very useful when slimes are jumping at you. Clubs can pound the ground, sending an ace flying, and with a dagger, you can perform a super quick triple strike attack. Be safe. Be safe. Let's get some Skyrim blues. Ready. Huh. We must have did this quite a bit later. Huh. Man. Rusty spur. That's not cool.
sheeps yeah yes indeed Ooh, the void chickens don't want to go out they want to hang out in here that's okay you guys can hang out in there no one's saying you have to go outside all right let's throw the milk in here let's throw the wool in here let's throw the goat milk in there Let's go build the obelisk. So hype. Okay, we're gonna do it, man. We're gonna build this obelisk. It's kind of exciting. It's kind of exciting. Not really sure where we're gonna put it, but you know, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Uh, where's my horse? I should get the horse. I should get the horse. Let's go grab a uh, Sokudo. Let's go, Sokudo. We'll just leave those there for now. We'll come back for those later. We'll come back for those later. Let's go. Let's go. Hmm. All right, wizard. Yeah, yeah, I need to set up. So, Amber, you bring up a good point here about the bot. So, I have some decent news. I mean, it's not like wonderful, amazing news or anything, but Monday is a national holiday for Japan. So I am going to try to do some stuff on Monday for the stream. Maybe set up a night bot, um, work on some stuff. Okay, look at this, we can build it. This is huge. Oh, it is three by three. It is three by three. Uh, so yeah, I'm. I got Monday off, so I plan on doing some stuff for the stream. Oh wow, finally done. All right. So um, hopefully, I will do some stuff for the stream, and uh, we can get. Maybe I can get a nightbot going. And uh, I plan on working on a couple of overlays that I've been wanting to work on, so it's kind of cool. It's kind of exciting. Well, we could build them right here. We could build one here, and then we could build one here. That looks kind of nice. I think that looks kind of nice. We can't move it down, though. It, it'd have to be right here. So we could build one right here. And then build the other one right here. So one right there and one right there. That's kind of nice. I think that will look good. And they're sort of out of the way. We could like build a path in front of them. I think that looks really nice. I think that would be cool. Hmm. What do you think? I think it looks that would look all right. All right, we're going to do it. 
It just builds instantly. And then all your money goes away. All right, we got it. We got it. Yeah, just let me know. Uh, you can whisper me on Twitch or DM and Discord. Okay, great. Yeah, I might need your help. <laughs> Um, but that's something I want to do on Monday. I want to use some of the time on Monday to get some things done. I'd like, I want to, I want to commit a little bit of time to the stream. Maybe we can, we can improve a few things with the stream. Um, so yeah, it'll be cool. I'm, I mean, it's kind of nice to have a holiday off. The thing about Japan though, is like you get a holiday off, but... I don't know. In a way, you're just sort of like postponing your work. If that makes any sense. Maybe that doesn't make any sense. Like, you're just going to come back and it's going to be even more work than you had before. Maybe, maybe that makes sense. Like, it doesn't really... Like, it, it doesn't... It's not like it feels guilty. That's not what I mean. It's not that it feels guilty. It just... It's just a reality. Like, you're going to come back and you're going to have all the more work to do. So, it's kind of weird. It's kind of like I would almost rather work. Just so that when I come back, it's not as brutal. But uh, we'll see how it goes. It's going to be a busy week next week. But uh, it's cool that we get a holiday. We get a Monday off. Okay. That's right. We're going over here to... Tap a couple more trees. Yeah, it's kind of like, yeah, it's you come back and it's just like even more work than you had. Um, not to complain. I feel like I complain a lot on stream. I need to stop doing that. I, I don't, I don't mean to complain. It's not like I'm like, you know, it's just the thing. It's just kind of the reality of the situation. But the cool thing is... And the positive thing is, is that I get a little extra time to, like, focus on the stream. So we'll set up that night bot. And uh, I'm working on another overlay. I'm working on some emotes. So, oh, and Amber, type in um, Slippy Fine. Ooh, there's a new emote. Oh my gosh, I didn't even mention it. There's a new emote, Slippy Fine. Slippy Fine works now. It was approved. So Slippy Fine finally works. Ooh, tap this tree. There it is. <laughs> Whoop. Yep, Slippy Fine. I think it looks pretty good. It's it's kind of, it's a it's a cute one and it matches the overlay. So the little giraffe is like sinking into this slime stuff that's on the overlay. It's pretty neat. I, I thought so anyway. The giraffe is saying it's fine. That's my first emote with Franker faces. So, it took a few days, but they did approve it. Sandy wants a jade. Sandy wants a jade. Alright. Let's see. What's coming up? Oh, that's the flower dance. Flower dance is coming up soon. Fine. 
Oh, we got Skyrim booze. We got Skyrim booze. Skyrim booze. Yeah, I know. I need to, like, get to work. Make some more emotes. The Cluck Cluck one would be pretty great. I kind of want to make... Yeah, that would be cool. It would be so cool to make a chicken. Like a, a jello... A jello emote. <laughs> make a make an emote in honor of our little friend Jello. Oops. Let's see. Make some more mayonnaise. Check and see if we got any more truffles. But it looks like no. Oh, maybe that's a truffle? No, there's no truffles today. It seems there's no truffles today. Oh, close the gates. Close the gates. Close the gates. All right. And let's throw this in there. Alright. And well, Mr. Miyagi's like passed out. I'm gonna start another new game just to check out the dog. I'm curious. <laughs> You're gonna start all well, I guess that's true. You get the dog really early, right? You get the you get the animal like really early in the game. It wouldn't take long to check it out. The dog is really cute, too. The dog is super cute. He, like, runs around and he barks. It's pretty great. Tovra, my buddy Tovra, he's got a dog. He decided to get a dog. Let's go check out this, uh, this... Look at it, it's so cool! It looks really cool. Alright, we're gonna build a path. Oh god, that was an accident. <laughs> well, that's how it works. <laughs> Oopsie. Oh, well, that's how it works. That was an accident. I was just trying to put down paths, and then we just warped. Man, there's nothing on the beach. But it'll make it much faster to check the beach on a daily, on the daily. Come to the beach, look around for artifacts, go back home with the, with the return scepter. So yeah, right now there's nothing here. So we can return scepter back. BJ Blaskowitz asks, do you have a Nintendo DS? I do. Yep, I got I got a Nintendo DS. It's around here somewhere. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's around here somewhere. I actually don't know exactly where it is at the moment, but I'm pretty sure I got one. I was trying to lay down a path, uh, not warp, but uh, I didn't play. I've never played Harvest Moon for the DS. No, I never played that game. It's going to look really nice. Like, we can make a path. Just like that, and then like we can build the other one right here. Um, they'll look really cool, man. I'm excited. They're gonna both be there. It's gonna be pretty hype. Oh man, look at all that booze. I think I'll put the lightning rod over here. 
Man, I'm, I'm actually really liking the farm a lot. I think the farm looks really good. Oh man, we're, we're out of time. There's no way I can plant all that booze in time. We'll, we'll pass out again like we did the other day. That's not worth it. We'll, we'll just wait and put it out tomorrow. It's fine. We're not in a real big hurry. Um, yeah, I never played the DS. I never played the Harvest Moon game for the DS. My DS, I played a lot of uh, Advance Wars. I really love that game. Advance Wars is a really fun game. It's one of my favorite games, portable games. Uh, really love Advance Wars, although the very last one was not very good. Um, I can't remember. The last one had, like, very realistic graphics. Like, all the care. Oh my gosh, this is so bad. Alright, well, we have a bunch of, uh, we have a, fruit, a bunch of fruit in there as well that's ready to go. Um, yeah, the, la the last Advance Wars game, I can't remember the name of it. What was the last Advance Wars game called? I think it was called, like, Days of Ruin, if I'm not mistaken. I think it's Days of Ruin. Hey, oh my gosh, NL Spoony, what's up, man? It's good to see you. Um, yeah, I think it was Days of Ruin. Anyway, that's not a great game. It's it's okay. Oops. It, it's like okay. But I really like the the first one, Black Hole Rising, which is for the Game Boy Advance. Um Black Hole Rising was really good. I think Black Hole Rising might be the best game. And then the um, uh, Advance Wars Dual Strike was really good, too. That was the first one for the DS. Um, but Black Hole Rising is my favorite. That one was really good. Man. All right. Now I kind of want to get the other one. <laughs> I kind of want to get the other one just to, like, make my farm look super dope. But we're kind of... We could probably get it. We could probably get the other one. It wouldn't take much work. Um, we just need to sell a bunch of wine. What's up, little kid? How's it going, my wife? I hope you've been practicing your moves. Tomorrow is the flower dance. Oh, man. I wonder if you can ask another woman to dance with you. Or, or a man. That would be so horrible. Clear and sunny tomorrow. Perfect weather for the flower dance. The event will take place in the forest starting between 9 and 2 p.m. Don't be late. Uh, not good luck. I kind of want to do it. I kind of want to do it. I think I'm going to rob from the, the stash. Tomorrow we're all getting together for the flower dance. If you can find a partner, you might even want to participate in the dance yourself. Well, I have a wife. There's a little clearing beyond the forest west of town where we hold the dance. We'll ride between 9 a.m. and 2 p.m. if you're interested. Right. Oh, Junimo! What's what is he doing? Where are you going, buddy? Man, he's lost his mind. <laughs> I don't know where that Junie Mo's going. He's just like me. Junimo, yeah, yeah, he, yeah, right. He's gone rogue. He's decided he's done with working for Slippy. 
He's done with Slippy's dirty work. What's up, Mr. Meowgi? Love that cat. It's a great cat right there. Such a good kitty. See? <laughs> oh, well, he decided to go back to work. Rogue Junie Mo. It's really good. Oh my god, we have so much to do today. Okay, we have a ton of stuff to do today. We have a lot of stuff to do today. A lot of stuff to do. But we'll, we'll easily get that million. We'll easily get it. Very easily. I feel like uh, I'm really glad we uh, we're getting a chance to stream tonight. Everything's super chill. Uh, thanks for hanging out with me. I really appreciate it. I'm glad you're uh, you're you're all stopped by. Really appreciate you guys spending your time with the Slippy stream tonight. Really appreciate it. Uh, NL Spoonie says, uh, can you pick a couple? Of your gender for the dance. Yes, you can choose your own uh, gender. Yep. Yep, you can. Um, the question I was wondering is, can you choose another partner that's not your wife or husband? Which seems, if nothing else, rude. Um, but uh, I, I imagine your 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 partner would not appreciate that. Your wife, your wife or husband would not appreciate that at all. I kind of wonder what happens, but uh, I'm too nice of a guy to do that. Like, I'm too nice of a human being in real life <laughs> to, like, to do that to my loving Maru. I can't do that to Maru. I can't do that to Maru. I can't. I just can't. Oh, the other thing I'm going to do on uh, the weekend, maybe Sunday, I think I will stream Sunday because I don't have to work Monday. Um, so I think I will stream Sunday and I will try to get the rest of the YouTube videos up and the entire Stardew Valley series will be on YouTube. Come on, man. It's only dancing. Yeah, I know, but it's a love event in this game. So, if you dance with someone, their hearts go up substantially, so it's more than dancing. It is more than dancing. It's the, the dance of affection. Extreme affection. Okay. Alright, let's go down here. We're almost done. Almost done. Whew. So much booze. So much booze. Okay. I think we got them all. Let's just take a quick look. Make sure they're all pulsating. It's like a hug that turns into pregnancy. Yes, exactly. Um, I think they're all good. I don't think we missed any. Oh, my lord. Oh, 
Oh my lord, look at all this preserves. No, don't eat the cranberries today. Oh yeah, we'll easily get that million. We'll easily get it. It'll be no problem at all. Pickled cauliflower, tons of wine. How do you, you adopt? you have a same-sex relationship, uh, you do adopt. Right. Are they all pulsating? They are all pulsating. Okay. Alright, we managed to get it all done by 2.30, 2.40 in the afternoon. Out. Animals out. Let them out. Let them out. Abigail's awesome. You will not be, you will be very happy to pursue Abigail. Abigail's great. I really liked her a lot. Yep, you can adopt if you are the same sex. Okay. Alright, it's gonna be a lot of cash tomorrow. No problem. No problem. We will make plenty of money for tomorrow. We will make plenty of cash. Wow, we are out of copper. Wow. Crazy, we are completely out of copper. We went ham on that. Yeah, I like Abigail a lot. I think Ab Abigail's great. She was one of my favorite characters. Ooh, Spoonie also likes Abigail. Yeah, I think Abigail's great. I really liked her, but I was... I kind of just was really, like... I, I really liked Maru a lot, and I'm glad. I'm really happy with my decision to marry Maru. I think she's a great character. And there's some really charming writing. Some very, very charming writing with, Ab uh, with uh, Maru. Took, we took care of a lot of farm stuff today, which is important. All right, we need to visit Clint again relatively soon. We are almost out of uh, materials again. Okay, so let's go see what we need to make the mountain. Um... Oops. Make the mountain. Again. I liked the nursing. Yeah, the nursing was pretty cool. Pretty cool. <laughs> oh man, those emotes are just so good. Oh my gosh. Let's go down here. Okay, let's go find out what's involved to make the, the mountain one. Alright, let's see what we need to do. Alright, so the earth one requires 10 earth crystals and 10 iridium bars. That should be no problem. Do we have 10 earth crystals? I'm not sure. 
I'm actually not sure if we have 10 Earth Crystals. Hmm. I actually don't know if we have 10 Earth Crystals. I don't know. Let's go check. Let's go check. I'm kind of... I'm, I'm, I'm sort of leaning toward no. I, I think we don't have 10. We may not be able to make this thing. We may have the money for it, but we may not be able to make it. You have 100 of everything? I don't think so. I'm actually... I'm f somewhat... We have four. <laughs> okay, that's a problem. But I think we can put them in here. Yep, you can. This game is crazy. Yeah, it's 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 pretty it's pretty cool. It's a pretty great game. I wanna, how much, how do you make chrysalariums? How do you make chrysalariums? 99 stone, 5 gold, 2 iridium, and 1 battery pack. It's very complex, yeah, absolutely. For sure, for sure. Alright, so we need 10 of those. 2 of those. 2 of those. What else? Chill tomate. Uh, 99 stone, one battery pack, okay, a bunch of stone. Oh wow, we got Skyrim booze over there. Okay, let's make this. We're gonna make a chrysalarium. Or we're not? What are we missing? Oh, five gold bars. Ugh, okay. Five gold bars. of those gold bars, not just... I think... Okay, we need 15. Oh, wait, what was it? It was... Oh, I think it was 10. So... Alright, let's make a chrysalarium. We have a chrysalarium in here, we're gonna grab it. Oh, and I was supposed to grab that other earth crystal. So we're just gonna go ahead and, and uh, copy some some uh, earth crystals. So, knock this out. Put this other chrysalarium. And there we go. We'll have those in no time. All right, we will have those earth crystals in no time. Like, one of the, like, it's hard to believe that one dude made this game also. That's something I have to like constantly remind myself is that this game was made by one guy. 
Like, I mean, I'm sure he, like, licensed people to help him, like, build graphics and music and stuff like that. Visual assets and things like that. I'm sure he didn't do everything on his own. But he did most of the work on his own. And I think he did all the programming on his own. So that is just amazing. It's quite a feat for one person. That is someone with a lot of vision and drive. I mean, like, to say the very least. Alright. Let's check the beach. Let's check the beach. Wow, we are not so lucky. Not so lucky. Hmm. Wow. These uh these two relics are gonna be tough. Hmm. They are going to be tough. I heard uh, it was only him 10 hours a day for four years. Really? Man, that is crazy. I wonder, I mean, if that's the case, then maybe he did do it all entirely on his own. Gosh, what, a, what an insane feat. Um, that is some ridiculous commitment. But extremely admirable. Admirable? I don't know. Maybe I'm not saying that word correctly. Admirable, all right? Admirable? I think so. It, it, it's an amazing game. Like, seriously, he must have had, like, just such a powerful vision of what he wanted, you know? To stick with it for so long. It's just really amazing. It is amazing. All right. I want to check something. Let's see. How do you make that uh, life elixir? One red mushroom, one purple mushroom, one morel, one chanterelle. So we need a purple mushroom to make one of those. I, I like. I'm curious if these things are worth anything. Like if you build them. So we need one morel and one purple mushroom. Let's let's see what happens. All right. One morel. Wow. We don't have really many morels at all. make one of these life elixir all right let's throw these in there oh it's one o'clock he is the sole developer oh, me too i'm really curious how the multiplayer is going to work as well i'm very very curious also Oh, look at Raphael. Look at that. He's second only to Maru. He's only second only to Maru. Rachel's really down there. Rachel does not care about her dad. <laughs> she does not care. She's just like, "Eh, you're you're just, you're not a dude." Well, you are a dude, but I I don't care about you. Okay. Um, let's go to bed. Look at that, 359,000. 
188 bottles of ancient fruit wine. Cranberry wine is not particularly valuable. Man, it looks like strawberry jelly is worth quite a bit. Wow, I think I should start like making strawberry wine. Maybe strawberry wine is worth quite a lot more. Yeah, I'm sure. And I mean, now he's got enough money. Wow, we actually didn't have a million. I was over-exaggerating. Close, though. Very, very close. Let's see. It's going to be a beautiful sunny day tomorrow. Spirits are somewhat annoyed. Plum pudding. Little Jack Horner is chomping at the bit for this ooey-gooey delight. And who can blame him? The plums are floral and sweet with just the right amount of tartness for fully activate energy. Activate every last one of your eager taste buds. You'll have to try it and see for yourself. There's Rachel. Finally, you're up! I was getting so hungry! Rumble! Okay, we can't kiss, I guess. Out of wild honey. I wonder what it's. I mean, like, I've experienced some success in my life, but I wonder what it's like to work that hard on something, you know? Like, and then to have it finally realized, and then you get rewarded for it substantially. Like, I mean, he's made millions off this game, right? So, I wonder what it's like to that have that kind of achievement, and then, you know, like, what do you do next? Like, what do you do after you've accomplished the greatest masterpiece of your life? Maybe, maybe I mean, maybe he thinks there's even more for him, you know? Maybe there's another something even bigger that he wants to work on next. But it, it seems like it would leave you kind of broken in a way. Like, what, what do you do after you achieve something so great? And then everybody is going to, like, hold it to you as a, as a level of quality. Like, he'll never be able to make anything without being compared to Stardew Valley. Do you know what I mean? I, that must be a very strange thing to have to deal with. Um, but, uh, you know, I don't know. Maybe, maybe it's really easy to deal with. Maybe he's just super happy that his game was a tremendous success. I can. This game is so good. Like... I, when I started playing this game, I had no idea, like, how good it was going to be. Um, I knew that a lot of people really enjoyed it and really liked it, but I had no idea what to expect, and it's so much better than what I expected. I don't even know how to put it entirely into words, but, I mean, I only started playing this because I hurt my hands so badly in Dark Souls. Uh, I really hurt my hands pretty bad playing Dark Souls, and uh, I needed to play a game that I could play with a mouse. So that's how I started playing this game, through a recommendation from a friend. And I was, at first I was like, eh, you know, I'll play this for a couple weeks, and, you know, when my new controller comes and my blisters on my hands heal up and all that stuff. And, uh, man, I was just like, and now I've played this game for 39 days straight. <laughs> Uh, so there you go. <laughs> it's kind of it's kind of crazy. Like I mean, this is like basically the main game of my stream. But I do play Dark Souls too, so both games I consider both games to be important. Little Junimos. Do your work, little Junimos. Alright, I guess we'll go to this festival. May as well, right? Let's go to the festival. Alright.
right, here we go. Little festival. I didn't think it was uh, Oasis 93 says, uh, 93X. Uh, I didn't think it was gonna be much of anything until I started to play it and now I can't stop. Yeah, it's that good. It really is that good. Um, there's not been one day that I've been playing this on stream where I was like, I don't wanna play this game. Like, I, that's there's never been a day. I, I swear to you. There has never been a day where I was like, I don't want to play this game. I always want to play this game. Like, and I've played it for almost 40 days straight. Like, not straight, but, you know, you know what I mean. Uh, yeah. And Amber says, I got it yesterday, played for 10 hours, and I'm hooked. Man, it's a great little game. Alright, we got, we could buy another Rare Crow. Why not? Buy some tubble flowers, daffodils, and dandelions. Eh, we don't really need to do that. This is an open field. It makes me nervous. Happy thoughts, Kent. Happy thoughts. Oh my god! Are you going to be dancing today, Slippy? I think so. Hi, Slippy. Glad to see you here. Wore my best shirt for the dance. This sort of thing doesn't happen very often. I should have brought my fishing pole. <laughs> Frog season is really starting to pick up. You know what? I admit it. I really like flowers. Ugh. I really hate dancing in front of everyone. It's so embarrassing. I love that this thing is pulsating. This, like, what is this, like, a cranberry? Cran a mound of cranberry, I think? Mmm, excellent slop, sauce, slurp. These springtime dances can be traced back to ancient fertility rituals. Ah, the air smells so sweet with all these flowers. I wonder if Emily would dance with me. All you gotta do is ask her. I wish Pierre would spend this time with the family. <laughs> Woo, I'm stuffed. Have you tried the red jelly yet? Someday I'm gonna be the flower queen. That's not fair. Why can't I be the flower queen? You can, Vincent. You can be the flower queen, buddy. Gulp, I'm nervous. I kind of like Penny, too. I think Penny's really sweet. I'm working up the courage to ask someone to dance with me. Better not be my wife. Stay away from my wife. I like dancing, but this one's a little stilted. The old timers really love it, though. I don't think... Uh, Amber says, I don't think I'd like it quite as much if it had f fancy 3D graphics either. The pixel graphics are perfect. It, the style is perfect, yeah. The... Everything... I love the graphics. I love the... Everything about it, the colors, it's all beautiful. Um, yes, dear? Ask Maru to be your dance partner. Of course. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Are you seeing this? Of course. Then we can go home and snuggle? Oh, look at that. Aw, look at that, so cute, Maru, my wife. Aw, she's so cool. Look at that. Nice. Oh, hello there. It's nice of you to talk to me. Spring is almost over. What a shame. Sigh. Love is in the air, and I'm still single. No, you're not. Come on, now. Everybody knows what's up. Marnie looks lovely to you. Ooh, Marlin. Ooh, Marlin. Marlin, what are you doing, buddy? I'm practicing my dance move. It needs to be perfect. I'm just enjoying the scenery. <laughs> I'm just enjoying the scenery. <laughs> wow, you're a real scumbag, Alex. Alright. Flowers? I can hardly see them. 
I've been working on these floral arrangements for a week. Do you like them? All right, let's get this thing going. Well, should we start the dance now? Yes, let's start. Let's get going. Oh my god. Slip is dancing. Oh, look at that. So sweet. Except I don't have the right outfit on. It's really weird. was fun time to go home all right all right let's take care of stuff real quick let's take care of stuff real quick we're um we're gonna stop selling these uh strawberries because they're actually i think they're actually more valuable to us um, turning them into stuff. Uh, I think we need to stop. I think we need to stop doing that. Um, because I, I think they're legitimately worth mo more to us as jelly and uh, wine. So I think we need to stop selling them just as, as they are. <laughs> Maru's Hawny. Oh my god. Okay, let's get... Man, we're out of ore again. Holy crap, we plowed through that ore. We have 75 bars of iridium. It's just nuts. I guess we'll make some gold bars tomorrow. You never know. Maybe we need them for something. Let's see. Let's throw this in there. I think we could probably pull that that uh, hay out. There we go. And it's 17 pieces. We got 246. Let's close this. Let's close this. Oh wow. Ooh, we got uh, we got honey. God, so much honey. Oop. No, we need snuggle time. We need snuggle time. We can't. We can't waste time. We need snuggle time. Maru wants snuggle time. You have to seize the opportunity. You have to seize these moments. All the gentlemen out there will know what I'm talking about. Alright, hold on. Okay, that's not ready. Alright, that's cool. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's throw those in there. Let's throw those in there. 22. Wow, we got Skyrim booze. We're back in business. We're back in business for Skyrim booze. Um, back in business for Skyrim booze. Alright, I'm gonna put these down there. Okay. Alright, not bad. We took care of everything today. Um, 
Okay, that's a wrap. That is a wrap. And, oh, our kid is still awake. Oh my god, this is so creepy. Why are our children awake? Why are our children awake? <laughs> so weird. Why are you guys awake? Let's talk to it, Mario. Are you awake? No? Alright. Let's go to sleep. Whew. Oh man, Dova! What's up, man? How are you doing, Dova? It's good to see you tonight. Wow, where did we get 10,000 from? Oh, blue jazz honey. And a bunch of mead. Did that put us over the million? Huh. No, we, we don't have a million. Hmm. Interesting. All right, guys. But that's going to be it for me. Um, Dove, I'm so sorry you just got here. Um, but I gotta go to bed, guys. I've had a really long day. <laughs> I'm gonna smoke with my people. Oh my gosh. Um, man, I'm sorry. I gotta... Yeah, I know. I just got... Yeah, dude, I had a long day today. I had to teach five classes out of seven. Uh, and I'm just... I'm worn out. Um... Yeah, dude. I, I I hope I'll see you next time. I do want to thank Melody of the Wolf for following uh, today. Um, thank you for following. And Oasis93, it was good to see you again. Good night to you. Um, I think I will... Let's see if Tovra's on. If Tovra's on, I'll, I'm going to send you guys over there. Hopefully you'll enjoy... Yeah, he's playing Stardew Valley. You guys want to watch some more Stardew Valley? Why don't you go uh, check out my my friend Tover's stream? Why don't you go over there and uh, if you if you want to go check out his stream, I think that would be really cool. So let's type that in. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, copy this. Um, but uh, man, please please go say hi to Tovra. Let's let's give him a message. Shouldn't uh shouldn't you Oops. Shouldn't you be farming and get good? There we go. Something like that. Amber, thank you for those 50 bits. So why don't you, if you wouldn't mind, please go, uh, please come with me and say hello to Tovra for a little bit. And you guys can watch some more Stardew Valley. It seems like a great thing to do, wouldn't it? Um, but I want to thank you guys for hanging out with me for a little while. I really appreciate it. Um, thanks for checking out the, uh, the stream tonight and uh, hope you enjoyed it uh, we'll be back tomorrow I hope I see, get to see you tomorrow um, and uh, yeah thanks so much you guys I'll see you guys next I, I'm so tired I'm sorry <laughs> I can't even think straight but let's go see Tovra all right let's have a good day and as I always tell you guys Oyo Simnesai I'll see you next time right and Jama Let's put this raid in there. There we go. Alright guys, I'll see you next time. Oh yeah, see you side. Jamatane. See you guys. Have a good day. Enjoy your day. I'll see you next time.